Hello, everyone. Uh, thank you for attending this meeting. This is the uh, public meeting for the Hanley and Central Meadowbrook Area Street Reconstruction Project, uh, 2018 bond year three, contract nine. Our city project number is 101472-2. My name is Greg Robbins. I'm a project manager with the Transportation and Public Works Department. The purpose of this meeting is to provide an overview of the project scope and the proposed improvements and provide information regarding the upcoming construction. This is my agenda for this short presentation. I'm going to uh, give an overview, overview of the project as a whole, provide a summary of the improvements that we expect to make, show a proposed construction schedule, and have some time for questions or comments. This map shows the project limits for each street on this contract. Number one is Benton Avenue from Old Hanley Road to South Hampshire Boulevard. Number two is House Street from Panola Avenue to the cul-de-sac to the south. Number three is Windomere Street from Benton Avenue to Springfield Street. And number four is Van Atta Lane from Emily Drive to Wyler Boulevard. I'll now go to a summary of the proposed improvements. Uh, here's some of the existing conditions on the street and the reason that we that these streets are being slated for reconstruction. You can see that there is damaged asphalt. There is a little lack of curb and gutter. We have areas that don't drain. And so these are the reasons that uh, these streets are being slated for repair. On Benton Avenue, we're going to be upgrading the existing six inch water to an eight inch, uh, upgrading the existing six inch sewer to eight inch. We're also going to be replacing the existing asphalt with new asphalt pavement and new concrete curbs and gutters and new concrete driveways up to the right of way line. On House Street, we will be upgrading the existing six inch water to an eight inch, upgrading the existing six inch sewer to eight inch, providing new asphalt pavement with new concrete curbs and gutters and new concrete driveways. On Windermere Street, we will be upgrading the existing six inch water to eight inch, upgrading the existing six inch sewer to eight inch, providing new asphalt pavement with new concrete curbs and gutters, as well as new concrete driveways. On Van Natta Lane, we'll be upgrading the existing six inch water to eight inch, replacing the eight inch sewer that is crossing Van Natta Lane in the alley, as well as providing new asphalt pavement with new concrete curbs and gutters, reconstructing damaged driveways, replacing portions of the existing sidewalk on both sides of the street, and also removing the fence between Emily and Grandview. These next two slides show some pictures of what the new street is going to look like. So we'll, we will have new asphalt pavement with new concrete curves and gutter. We will be replacing driveways with new concrete driveways, as well as um, making some improvements to sidewalks in some areas. The proposed construction schedule for this project shows the construction start date of August 2nd. Um, the, we will be moving to House Street next and completing the utilities in House Street in two sections, the, the south side uh, from uh, starting at the south end from the cul-de-sac going north, we'll do that part first with utilities and then do the north half. After that, uh, we will do the pavement on House Street and then move to Van Atta Lane uh, with the utilities and then the pavement and then into Windermere and finally Benton. We plan to finish construction around August 1st, which is around 365 days, which is the total length of the project uh, contract. At this time, we would take questions and comments. Finally, here's the contact information for myself, as well as Eric Tinner, who will be the construction inspector for this project. Please feel free to contact me or Eric uh, whenever you have any issues regarding the construction and we'll be happy to get back back with you and help thank you <laughs> 